Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's Shalonda and this is Saving with Shalonda. Hello to all my returning subscribers and welcome to all the new subscribers. Thank you guys for being here. I'm coming on to um, introduce my new Etsy item to you guys. This is going to be my new um, DIY kit. It's called um, Cruise Control. So if that sounds like something that you're interested in, keep on watching. If you haven't yet subscribed to the channel, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Go ahead and smash the like button because you're going to like and you're going to love this video. Be sure to leave me some comments below. Be sure to watch the ads that play throughout the video and share my video. All right, guys. So I have already um, gotten my um, kit already laminated and hole punching into my um, new Saving with Shalonda weekly book that got all, has all my challenges and things in it. But I'm going to show you the pages of it. They're all double sided. So this is a, um, a 10 page down, 11 page download altogether, I believe. 12 page download. Okay. So the dashboards will be on one um, download, okay? So in A5 and A6, so cruise controls. You see the little O is the captain's wheel, okay? Cute. Let's go ahead and uh, put these into the envelopes now. Y'all know they fit if you've been with me for a long time, okay? All right. If if you have the ugly A the zippered envelopes, cut the borders off and they'll fit just fine, okay? But like I said, we're trying to get rid of um, zippered envelopes in 2024, okay? But for those of you who continue to use them, you know, cut the borders off, okay? There we go. A6. So these will look good, like I said, in these clear transparent envelopes and the other zipless envelopes, they look the best, okay? But like I said, y'all gonna do y'all anyway. So if y'all wanna continue with the zippered envelope, go right ahead, but cut the borders off. You have to squeeze it in there a little bit. All right, so here we go. Uh, the second page is going to be your um, game board. All right. So um, let me move this book out the way. The game board has the icons on it for all of the um, games that's included within the bundle. So you can kind of see it here. You'll start on this icon here. You can roll your dice and whatever icon you land on that would direct you to what game to play that's in your bundle. If you land on the captain's wheel here, you'll this is a, your choice. So you choose what game you want to play. All right. So your choice are the captain wheels and that's it basically. Okay. So you can kind of like see the icons kind of, like I said, vacation is cruise -ish, Okay. So like I said, this is the entire, um, made for cruise travel. You can use it for any type of vacation if you want to, but this, um, idea was one for, by one of my eight ones. She had the choice to uh, pick what my next, um, DIY bundle would be. And she wanted a travel theme, and I know that she loves cruises, so I wanted to highlight the cruise specifically in this um, kit. So here you go. So congratulations to Adrian for winning um, the um, idea for me to design this kit, okay? So shout out to my Etsy Betsy <laughs> in A1. All right, so those are pages two, one and two. All right. So the next page is your savings tracker. Okay, normally this is like a color and save page here. There's a hundred icons on here that represent the money that we're playing with. So for these passports here, you'll just come in and color in the globes on there. Okay, to represent the dollars that we're playing with. But these are just passports. Okay, if you wanted to not, you can use this individually as a savings challenge if you didn't want to track your money like that. And like I said, there's a hundred icons on here to get a passport. I think it's $110 to get one. If you want to get it expedited, it's about double that. So you can just make your icons a dollar here, a little bit more to make the um, $110 or double it and then do $200 to get the expedited passport if you want to make this an individual challenge by itself. But let's say for your passport. But like I said, I'm going to be using this as a savings tracker to keep track of the amount that we put in for each game. So normally we do $25 each week for Roll with a Wednesday. So that's what we'll be doing. So this will be my uh, monthly game starting next week. All right. And I'm just going to be saving for vacation. I want to go on a cruise. That's my hope one day. Okay. <laughs> uh, the next challenge is called Anchors Away. These are our mini challenges that come with all my um, DIY kits. Okay. So this is for loose change. So you don't get an IOU. So when you get down to your last little bit of money, you want to come here and play these games to, um, like I said, I usually set it for 25 cent, 50 cent, 75 cent. Then based on the roll of the dice, that's the icon I'm going to color in here. So I'll color in one of my anchors or you can just cross it off. If you don't like coloring. Okay. And that's that. Okay. This is um, a, a color and save challenge here. Okay. So we have, this is called travel essentials. So if you see, if you can see in the icons, guys, you have, um, in each bundle is 12 bundles. 
So 12. So you're going to roll a 12-sided die with this game here. So let me see which one we're going to pick. All right. So we got our 12-sided die. We'll go ahead and roll. We got number three for our um, bundle here. So one, two, three. And then after that, we're going to um, roll a six-sided die to determine what icon we're actually going to color in. All right. So three. So three, according to my um, legend up here, is the carry-on. So we would color in our carry-on bag here, okay? That's in the luggage set. So you see sunglasses, passport, boarding pass, carry-on, and then the actual luggage, and then a neck pillow, okay? Rolling suitcase. So those are um, the things that you'll be coloring in based on what you roll. And you can color many color of your choice, but you can roll both dice together as well if you wanted to. So we got 10 right here, and then uh, item number one. So we'll count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. And item number one is our passport, okay? And so we'll color in our passport on this set of luggage and icons here. And then, like I said, you can set, set your amount for your icons. I'm probably going to do like 50 cent or a dollar per icon to color in, okay? But a color and save challenge for those of you who, who like color and saves and also... For those of you who you might want to save up for a new luggage set or something like that, okay? Or you can say, put this towards your uh, plane ticket or anything else like that. But anything that has to do re related to travel, you can save for that using this challenge, okay? All right, the next challenge is called um, Whatever Floats Your Boat. So you see the water background, and this is just um, one through nine of Shut the Box. You see the different floaties here. So that's all it is, guys. That's how we do our Shut the Box normally. So you can save the amount after you roll. Yeah, I know how to play. Or like I say, I'm going to play it even an eye, how many, however many floaties I have left. A uh, dollar for eye floaties, and then $2 for even floaties or something left, okay? So you Shut the Box version of... Uh, for my cruise bundle. So whatever floats your boat, okay? Next challenge is called SOS, so saving ourselves. <laughs> All right, so uh, these are our cruise ships, and usually like you, when you go on a cruise, they want to, you know, you have that speech on the on the deck where they talk to you about um, life-saving procedures and all those type of things, all right? And so we have some um, life... Um, lifesavers and we have some life vests and so the goal is to make sure that each passenger on the ship gets one of these devices in case there is something happens on the cruise okay like that so we got 20 um lifesavers and vests and then we have the boats so the boats are colored okay and our three so we're going to use a colored dice or a spinning wheel to select our boat for our color okay then we're going to roll a 20-sided dice to eliminate a vest to make sure our passenger has that um, vest or um, life um, saver, okay? So we rolled um, an orange and we rolled 20. So we're going to come down to our orange ship and then we're going to come to the 20th icon. So the first 10 icons are life savers. Then 11 through 20 are the life vests. So in that case, we would cross off the um, life vest. A so passenger number 20 had the life vest on the orange boat, okay? So the goal here is to get... Uh, uh, just make sure each boat is, each passenger on each boat has their um, life um, jacket and um, lifesaver, okay? So you're going to set an amount for, um, you can do like odd, like if you, um, if the lifesaver or life vest is odd, you can save um, like $2 or whatever amount you want to save, okay? I'm probably going to do, there's a lot of icons on here. So I'm probably going to do 50 cent for the odd icons and a dollar for the even icons. If I roll a 20, then I'm just going to cross it off and then until I finish. But like I said, the goal is to just get everybody a life, uh, <laughs> life saving device. That's it. All right. So SOS. And then, like I said, you can make it a race and see which boat finishes fast because y'all know I like a race, okay? Y'all know I like a good race, so <laughs> you can do it like that. And then you can set a, um, an additional amount to save for whatever boat, or you can put your put your money on what boat you think going to win or get the uh, passengers a life jacket first, okay? So there you go. I didn't put that in directions, but I probably, I probably could. <laughs> I haven't put it on Etsy yet, okay? And then we go to the open bar because that's the best thing about um, vacation and cruises and <laughs> anything is open bar, okay? So, uh, you know, you have to uh, buy uh, drink packages on um, cruises, okay? 
And so this is going to be used to say for that. Like I said, if you're, if you're not an alcoholic or anything like that, that's anybody's alcoholic. But if you don't drink, just these will be mocktails for you. But these are, you know, cocktails for the rest of us <laughs> and stuff like that. So this is basically just like a roll and save. Um, the drinks are here. Okay. So one through six dice. So we got a six and we got the little green little drink. So we'll cross that off and we can save whatever amount. We can save six dollars here if we wanted to. Or we can save um, like an even like an even amount for um, even rolls. So maybe two dollars, one dollar, whatever you want to save is based on your budget. Yeah, I know how I do my challenges. I want it to be specific to you, your budget. So I'm probably going to do 50 cents and a dollar here as well. Yeah, I know that drink packages can be upward to three or four hundred dollars for the cruise. That's the most expensive part of the cruise. It's probably more expensive than the room sometimes. <laughs> but, you know, most people gonna get the drink package. You have to buy a soda package as well. Like it's all included. But if you add the alcohol part of it, you have to just bump it up a little bit more. So most people just go ahead and get the alcoholic package. So that ensures that you get unlimited drinks. I think about 15 to 20 drinks per day. Okay. <laughs> While you're vacationing, okay. So that's what this is for. But like I said, if you don't drink, don't mind the alcoholic drinks. Think of it as a mocktail. Get a mocktail. No alcohol virgin. Get a virgin, okay? So roll and save. Four. We got this little drink here. So we'll cross that off and then uh, save the coordinated amount, okay? So that's that. I don't want to set my amounts now. We'll set my amounts. I'm going to do 50 cents for odd and a dollar for even, okay? Okay, the next game is called Above Deck, and this is gonna be our card game, guys. Okay, and as you can see, it has the little uh, the little ship windows. Okay, and you can see I have the suits in the windows. All right, and so the goal here, the, the directions say you're gonna roll one dice. All right, we got a two. Okay, so we're gonna move two spaces. So one, two. So we're on the heart. Okay. So the the highest the um the suits range highest to lowest and um so the highest is the spades the next is the heart diamond club that's highest to lowest so spades heart diamond club so what you want to do is you want to try to beat um what this is so this is a heart so in order to beat this I I must pull a spade but you're gonna set your amount you're gonna guess if it's either gonna be lower or higher than what your guess is okay so I'm gonna put. Let's see. It says, if you guess correctly, save. Let's see. You don't have to save anything, really. Let's let's do 50 cents if you guess correctly. No, let's see. I'm going to do 50 cents. And I'm going to do... I'm going to do 50 cents for both. And then if you pull the same suit, pull another card. If you land on a spade, automatically save a dollar because spade is the highest suit can nothing can beat that okay so there we go all right so let's try to let's let me try to play this all right <laughs> so here we go like i said we went we're here okay so we're gonna go ahead and um see what we get so we need a spade what we're gonna guess i'm, I'm gonna say that it's gonna be let's see heart I'm going to say lower. I'm going to say it's lower than a heart. So I need to pull at least, a, I need to pull a diamond or a club to make sure that I'm right. Diamond or a club. I pulled a spade. It's higher, so I'm incorrect. So I would just put an X on there, and then I'm going to save my 50 cent. All right, because I was wrong. Okay. But then we go again. You go three. One, two, three. We we on the spade. So, like I said, the spade is the highest. So the spade automatically wins, guys. Okay. I should be marking a print and um dry erase off so I can get rid of this. Okay, so uh spade is automatic, so you're gonna save a dollar for that. Okay, because can't nothing else beat the spade. Okay. Or they're all gonna be lower than a spade, rather, I guess. Okay. <laughs> so there we go. So that's how you play above deck. But like I said, I'll be back for a more um, detailed tutorial on how to play these games. All right. When we get done showing everything. All right. Our next game is called uh, Paradise. Okay. And uh, to play this game, the direction says to get to paradise, get to, it says get to paradise by rolling a pair of dice, <laughs> which is doubles. Okay. Whenever you roll double, save the amount rolled and color in the dice. For example, roll double twos, save $2 and color in a two die. For lower income, save, let's see, we're going to say 50 cents for odd and a dollar for even. Okay. 
So basically what we're gonna do here, we're just gonna roll until we get doubles, guys. And then whatever one we get, we're gonna color in one of our eye cups. So here we go. Let's see when we get it. Double ones, okay? So we would go here. We were coloring the one, and then we'll save our 50 cent or a dollar, whatever amount we have saved, designated for odd rolls. And then the goal is to get down to paradise. And these are little islands here, guys. So these are our paradise, okay? <laughs> so whenever you roll all your dice down here, you, you made it to paradise number one. You roll all your twos here, you're down to paradise number two, okay? Three. Paradise number three and so on and so on, okay? But like I said, the goal is just to roll doubles, guys. And like I said, I'm just going to be paying 50 cents and a dollar for even rolls, okay? So that's how we that's how you can play that. But get to paradise by rolling a pair of dice, okay? <laughs> See the pun on words there, guys? Pun on words, okay? And then um, these are the scratch outs that come with the kit. I didn't put um, scratch out stickers on all of them so you can see the um, what's behind here. Okay, the first one is called Beach Balling on a Budget, like Balling on a Budget, okay? <laughs> but Beach Balling. So you got your beach balls here, and these are um, one through six, okay? Um, one through six. And so uh, you can save that amount that you scratch or uh, roll and save, or you can um, do set your other amounts for odds. So I'm going to do probably, I probably do $1 and $2 for even, like I normally do for my scratch offs. So $1 for odd, $2 for even. And then we got this one down here called um, get into the beach bag, like get into the bag, okay? But get into the beach bag, okay? <laughs> and so here you'll set your amounts for icons and then you'll scratch and save that amount or you can roll and save if you don't like scratch offs, okay? And so we'll just do this one here as a um, one, two, and three as well. So they're three different color bags. And like I said, I left them exposed so you can see some of them, okay? I'll go a little yellow one right there, a little white one with red stripes and then a white one with blue stripes. Got a little, you know, flip flop and stuff in the bag, but get into the beach bag. Get into the bag, okay? Beach balling on a budget, okay? <laughs> Y'all know I'm crazy. All right, and this is the A6 page as well. Uh, here, <coughs> excuse me, guys. So um, it has 12 icons, same situation. When I run out of scratch offs, I might just do this as a roll and save or something like that. And I can set my amounts for the same thing or less, depending on what I want to do. Okay? These can be cut up. They don't have to be in the book form. If you like scratch outs, you want to have your own individual binder. But you, yeah, I know that I'm into the gear of the savings challenge book. I want everything in one place. No more binders for me. Okay. <laughs> so that is the kit in a nutshell, guys. So let's, let's go ahead and look at it one more time. And then we're going to play the games. Okay. So page one again, the dashboard is cruise control. Okay. We got our cruise control game board. Okay, so page one and two. All right, so page three and four is gonna be our passport uh, savings tracker. There's a hundred icons on here to keep track of our games. Or like I said, you can make this an individual challenge and save up for your actual passport if you still need to get one. Or you know, I need, like my son still needs one. I probably can use that for this, but I'm not. It's a savings tracker. Whatever money I save from the games, I'm gonna take it and put it into just into my vacation fund and then I'll handle that from there, okay? So page three, then page four is um, Anchors Away Minis, okay? So this is our mini challenge to catch the leftover change, okay? So, so to avoid IOUs, travel essentials, color and save, okay? Page five. Page six, float your boat. This is the word, whatever floats your boat. Shut the box with floaties, okay? Page seven, saving ourselves, roll and save, color code it. You can roll a die or spin a color wheel, and then you're going to mark up your icons. This is a 20 um, die. You, like I said, if you don't have an actual 20-sided die, okay, you can use the, the Google dice roller on Google. Let me pull it up. I pull it up several times to show you guys. Now, type in dice roller on Google, and then you pick the dice that you need. I need a 20-sided die, and I roll it, and I get the number that I need. So I got one. So I will cross out that one, number one lifesaver, okay? And whatever color I roll for my boat, yellow, okay? Same thing, there. Are, there's also like a color wheel you can get to um, get the colors. I'll show it to you later if I can find it again. <laughs> but it's on Google, just type in color wheel, okay? So I said this is page seven. Page eight, 
um, open bar to save for our drink package. Another roll and save. Okay, you can also do a spin and save. Just put the numbers one through six on the spinner wheel, and you can still select your drinks that way as well. Okay, always multiple ways to play your games. All right. So we got a one there. Okay. So one is a coconut drink. So we'll mark that off. We'll save one dollar or whatever amount we have. I got fifty cent for I, so I'm gonna say fifty cent. All right. Above deck, our card game. You want to get above the suit. Like I said, this is based on um, the order of the cards. The highest suit is a spade. Spade, heart, diamond, club. So you want to roll for your spade to see if you can beat it. So two. Oh, so here we go. You're going to call it. So we back at the heart again. Uh, I'm going to say that it's going to be, I'm going to guess, I'm going to say lower. Okay? Lower than the heart. So I need to get a um, diamond or a club. And it's a club, so I win, so I'm correct. I'm just going to say 50 cent. I'm going to say 50 cent either way because I'm playing the game, okay? <laughs> or like I said, you can change yours differently how you want it to be. But like I said, you land on the spade. That's the highest suit. Nothing can beat it. So that's going to be an automatic um, win, okay? So there we go. So a lot of automatics here, okay? <laughs> so there we go. All right. I forgot what page we on. Let's see. This might be 10, I think. Okay, paradise. Okay, get to paradise by rolling a pair of dice, okay? So here we go. We just rolling for doubles, guys. You're gonna see the doubles you get. Okay, we got double ones again, okay? And so since we got double ones, we're gonna color in one of our ones here. We're gonna say whatever amount, we're gonna say either a dollar or whatever amount we have for odd rolls, okay? And then the goal is to get to paradise. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we're ten rolls away from paradise number one. Okay. <laughs> so that that's it. That's how you do it. And then you have your two pages of scratch offs. So pages eleven and twelve. So we got the scratch offs in eight, uh, five, beach balling on a budget because we on a budget. Okay. One through icons and one through six denominations. And get into the beach bag, okay? You set your amounts for the icon, then you uh, roll and save or scratch and save the bag that you land on, okay? And like I said, it's an A6 as well. There you go. They can be cut out or um, just, you know, left in the book like this. And that's it. All right, so now it's time to, like, play our game. I'm going to play for a little while, yeah, okay? <laughs> so here we go. So I can show you how to play. Okay, I'm going to put this up. Let me put my new bind. Let me put my new um, thing in here so y'all see how beautiful my binder is getting. Okay. I'm going to put this bad boy in the front. Look how cute that is. Y'all see how cute that is? This could be all yours, y'all. Okay. <laughs> Why y'all playing? Y'all know the place to go. Y'all want beautiful binders, beautiful challenges. Save a wish of on Etsy. Okay. Look, look how pretty that is. Look. Y'all see that? Look how good that look in there. Let's, let's just do a flip through just to show you how beautiful all the dashboards are. Okay. To remind y'all what's over on Etsy. Look how cute that is. Cute. <laughs> Love to say Valentine's Day date night. Happy birthday, kid. It's all about me, self-care, kid. Christmas cash part one. Roll color scratch DIY. Okay, Christmas cash, true, I need to move those around. Candy roll. Hairspray. Mario. All right. <laughs> so y'all got options, but look how, look how cute that is. Cute. Cute, cute, cute. Only on Saving with Shalonda, guys. Okay, cute. Where cuteness and money meet, okay? And fun me. Fun, cute, money. It all comes together. We're saving with Shalonda, guys, okay? <laughs> all right, let me get my butt on this game board, all right? I'm playing with prop money. I'm playing this on, this is going to start playing on Wednesday on the channel, okay? So I'm playing this for the month of April, basically, the end of March, month of April, to get some money for my uh, vacation fund, okay? All the money I save here will be going directly into my vacation sinking fund. All right, so we're going to set our um, amounts like I always do for our icons. We're going to do these to skip our turns when we already play the game, okay? So I do um, 10, 20, 30 cent, okay? But you can also, you can also if you don't want to play the game board the way that I do, you can um, make these icons whatever you want to, whatever you land on, and just make this an ind independent challenge, okay? And just save that way. But here we go. Let's play. Let's see how this goes, Okay. All right, we got one. All right, so we got the um, lifesaver, so the floaty, so that's uh, the shut the box. 
Y'all really need to play that? Yeah, I'm gonna play shit at the box, but let's see if I can shut the box to that because I've been on a roll. Hold on. <laughs> All right, hold on. Let me get it together. I mean, like I said, bef I mean, I'm not doing it for real, but like the first thing you want to do is you always want to count, put your money in. Like I usually pay $25, so I would, you know, color these in, okay? Before I start for me, because I'm using this as a tracker, okay? But, but to shut the box or whatever floats your boat. All right, so here we go, guys. Ain't it cute? I love the water background. I love it. Okay, so cute to look at. Purdy five. We just crossing out our, uh, the number combination. Is that right? Six. Seven. They gonna do it again in the row? What we get? Oh, nine. Okay. Six. Oh, what? <laughs> uh oh, uh, look, look, yeah. Oh, let me breathe. Let me breathe. <laughs> Here we go, yeah. Oh! <laughs> oh, I lied, yeah. I'm lying. I got a three steal. Oh. <laughs> Why do I think I had shut the box, y'all? I lied. I think the roll this other day. So let me roll this. I, I lied, y'all. I, I, I ain't see that one. Let me see. <laughs> All right, I didn't get it. All right, y'all, owe a dollar. Never mind. False. Okay, false alarm, false alarm. Now, let's do it again. I'm, I'm, I'm determined not. <laughs> uh, 1082. All right, five. All right, five again. Let's do four and one. All right, seven. Back with a vengeance, guys. Back with a vengeance. Three, four. We out. We got two left. A dollar. All right. So that's that. But y'all knew I already knew how to play Shut the Box, right? Because that's everybody's favorite game. So y'all know how to play that. But let me clean this board off real quick. Man, that false alarm got me, y'all. Got me. <laughs> I was so sure. All right. So that's that. We're going to go back to the game board. Okay. That hurt my feelings, y'all. All right, here we go. We got a three. All right, one, two, three. We got uh, the deck of cards game, so above deck. All right, so here we go. Let's see. All right, so we're going to... We're going to roll for what we're going to get. <clears throat> we got five. Let's just start here. One, two, three, four, five. We got the space, so that's the highest. And so that's going to be an automatic of uh, a dollar. If we land on space, so we're going to automatically save a dollar. Put our money up here so we'll see, keep track of how much we saved today. Okay? Because nothing can beat the spade. I do want to take this off of here. Like we got to come back to it. Like I say, guys, you just put like uh, dry erase on top of Sharpie to get rid of uh, Sharpie sometime. All right? All right, let's go again. Let's roll again. Two, one, two. We got diamond. Okay, I'm going to guess that my next guess is going to be, maybe I should do, if I guess right, if I guess wrong, I'm gonna, let's save a dollar if I guess wrong. We're going to make it different. Let's guess a dollar. Uh, so the diamond I need, I'm going to say, I'm going to say higher than, the diamond is the lowest, so everything's going to be higher, I guess, guys, right? No, the diamond, the club is the lowest, okay? So I'm going to say higher. Okay, I got a club and it's lower, so I'm wrong. So that's a dollar. All right, and so I'll go ahead and cross that one off. Where is we at right here? Okay, and then you can just do a check mark if you actually get your guess right, guys. Okay, so let's see two, one, two, spade, automatic win. So you could put a check mark there, right? X, X, and I. Because <laughs> is it a win? I mean, I guess it's a win because you're saving. Let's see, three, one, two, three. The club, the club is the lowest, so it's automatically gonna be higher as well. So maybe all the black suits should be automatic, maybe. I need to rethink the rules, guys, okay? But we're gonna say low, we're gonna say higher than the club, which we know is gonna be right. <laughs> it's a diamond, it is higher, okay? So we're going to uh, just say 50 cent, okay? So we got that right. Two. 
Let's see. We on the heart. One, two. Okay, heart. I'm gonna say I'm gonna say lower than the heart. I got the diamond. That's correct. I got that one right. So that's gonna be fifty cent. All right. Let's see. Six, one, two, three, four, five, six, club. Okay, I'm gonna say higher, it's higher. But like I said, I'm, I'm thinking if I have it land on the same suit, I can change the way the game goes a little bit. Like I said, this isn't on Etsy yet. So I might I might change the rules of this game to, to make it play the, the way I want it to play. So if you get a club, you get your own suit, you'll just um, say 50 cent. Okay, yeah. Roll again. One, two, three. I see a mind at work right now. Diamond. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to say, uh, I'm, oh, I got it put in my hand. Y'all, me. <laughs> I'm going to say higher than a diamond. Higher than a diamond. What'd I get? I got a spade that's higher. So I'm, I'm right. So I only got to say 50 cent. Okay. So that's how that goes, guys, for the most part. But like I said, I'm going to get back to you on the rules for this one. <laughs> I think I want to change this so it's more fun for me too, okay? So here we go. All right, so paradise. You need to roll a pair of dice to get to paradise, okay? So here we go. Oh, first one. We on number three, okay? I'm going to just exit out, guys, but you will color in the three dice. You will save $3 or uh, I'm saving 50 cent for mine, okay? So three or, or whatever amount you have for odd, Okay. Let's see. Okay, we got sixes. Okay. Color in a six. Uh, save six dollars or save the amount for even, which is a dollar for me. Okay. Let's go again. We rolling pairs of dice to get the paradise. All right, fours, okay? So we'll cross out a four, and then we'll save an additional dollar there, like that, okay? Let's do one more. Yeah, I probably be on my game board. I'm just rolling, playing games. <laughs> All right. All right, six again, so a dollar, okay? So like I said, I usually pay about three or four dollars per game, guys, because my budget usually is like $25 per week. And to show each game a little bit of love, that's the way that I like to do it, that I'm playing um, as many games as possible and, you know, showing all the games of love. But like I said, back to our game where I totally play that game out of order, okay? But here we go. Um, next game, nonetheless, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And we are, that's what, that was the next one to be played anyway, so we got it, okay? See how that work? One, two, SOS, all right. <laughs> so SOS is a saving ourselves, okay? So make sure we got a life jacket in case the uh, ship capsizes or something, y'all, okay? We gotta be safe out here on the water. All right, so here we go, y'all. Let's see. We need a color die, or you can use a spinner wheel to get your color boat. So let's do our color boat. We got the blue boat, which is right here. Okay, and then we're gonna roll our dice. We're gonna roll a 20 sided die to see what um, life jacket or life device was taken out. So we got number eight, and like I said, one through ten is the life jacket, life uh, things up here, lifesaver. So that's eight right there, and so that's an even life vest. So we'll save a dollar for the even life vest, and then a dollar 50 cent for the odd. So we can roll both of these dice together if we choose to. Then we're on the bo purple boat. Number 16, okay, purple boat, number 16. 16 is down here with the life jacket. So this is 20, 19, 18, 17, 16. So we take out 16, another even um, life-saving device. So it's gonna be a dollar, okay? Purple, number three. Top row, one through three is up here, okay? And so we'll eliminate an uh, uh, odd. So you say three dollars. I'm gonna say fifty cent for odd, whatever amount you set for those. Okay. Purple thirteen. Purple getting they shipped together. Okay. 10, 11, 12, 13. 
they getting the people right. Right? So that's how that goes. One more. All right, yellow. Number five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so just trying to remember one through ten. I was on for the life savers, like this, like the circle floaties. And then ten through twenty is going to be for your um, life vest, okay? When you're counting over for your icons. So that's how that goes, guys, okay? I'm going to clear that one off as well. Back to our game board. All right, we got um, three. One, two, three. We already played. Shut the box. Whatever floats your boat. So we're going to pay 20 cents to skip our turn. Let me bring my chips over here. You don't have to play it this way, guys, but this is the way I always play on my channel. I pay to skip my turns, okay? And then I roll again. Three, one, two, three. We played that one already as well. Above deck, so that's 30 cents. Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, we played the island game. We played it. We played everything, yeah. Let's see. One, two, three. Okay. I need to land on something. I still need uh six. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's the one I need. All right, we still need the drink game too. Okay, so that is the travel essentials bundle. Okay. So we'll go ahead and play this one. Like I said, this is the color and save. So like I said, there are 12 sets of luggage here. So you're going to roll a 12-sided die, and then you're going to roll a six-sided die to determine which one you're going to save. Okay. Okay, 10. We got luggage set number 10, which is here. Okay, then we got item number four. And item number four is going to be our carry-on, okay? So carry-on is four, so we're going to color on the color in the carry-on item, Okay. So we'll just, or exit out if you don't like color like that. All right. And then we'll say, I, I, like I said, I'm going to probably save like, do I want to do a dollar for each of my items? Let's see. Yeah, I know I'm cheap. I'm going to say a dollar for right now. <laughs> Let's take them 50 cents, more like 50 cents, but we'll see. A dollar might be fine. A dollar. We'll do a dollar. All right. So here we go. All right. Luggage set number six is here. And then we got item number two. Item number two is the boarding pass, so we will color in our boarding pass there, okay? And then we'll save another dollar per item, okay? So here we go. Let's go again. We got three, set number three, item number three, and that's going to be our sunglasses, so we will color in our sunglasses on, on luggage or travel essentials number three. All right, so that's how that goes, and we'll save a dollar. Like I said, if you do what, 12 times, 12 times six, $72 after you complete this entire challenge, okay? To save all the, at a dollar a piece per item, okay? So that can buy you, set you up for, um, tour the new lug luggage set, guys. And like I said, do it multiple times to set you up for, to buy your plane tickets and whatever else you need, okay? <laughs> Let's do one more here. Okay, 10 and, 10 and 1, okay? So this is 10 again. And then we got 1, and 1 is our passport. So we color in our passport here. Okay, so that makes sense? That's how you do it, Okay. Let me clean that up. All right. And the only thing we need to land on now is the um, the drink pack is the open bar. Okay. So let's see how we get to it. Two. One, two. We already played above deck and it's going to cost us 30 cents to skip our turn. Let's put take two of these back. Get this changed together, y'all. Okay. Come on. We need a, or the free space. Oh, we got it. There we go. One, two. We got your choice, the captain's wheel. So we are definitely going to go play the open bar because we thirsty. Okay. <laughs> Love an open bar, guys. All right. Love an open bar. All right. Here we go. So we're going to roll for our drink. So here we go. All right. Three. So that says that we are getting... Um, this Long Island, it <laughs> looks like. <laughs> All right. So right there, so that's three. All right, so we're going to put, uh, we're going to save $3. They're going to save, I got a uh, 50 cent for I drinks, guys. So we're just going to save my 50 cent because that's what I'm going to be saving. But you can save $3 or whatever amount you would like. All right. Two. Two is for um, this one here, this blue drink. Okay, so that's even. So that'd be a dollar. 
And then a couple more. Five. Five is for this little drink here with the umbrella. So that's an odd drink. Or you can save the five dollars. All right. And we got a coconut drink. All right. So 50 cent or a dollar for odd. All right. So that's it. Roll and save for those drinks. But they pretty to look at. And I'm pretty sure they taste delicious. If you go get one. Okay. <laughs> Mocktails are well, are good too when you when you've had too much as well. Okay, so now we played all of the games. So usually I play all my games first, and then I say I allow myself to play scratch offs. Okay, so here we go. We're at our beach balling on a budget. Okay, so we're going to roll for our scratch. We got a two. So here we go. One, two. So I'm going to scratch this off right here. I'm probably going to cover all mine, though, guys. I just want to leave some exposed so you can see what they look like. Okay. All right, we got a four. So we can either save $4, but I'm going to do even an I, so I'm saving $2 for those. Okay. Let's do another one. Three. Then one, two, three. We landed on three. So this, if I would have scratched, that would have been $3. So that would have been an odd one, or you save $3. Okay. So I usually do two or three at a time down here now. Okay, depending on how much money I got. Okay, so get into the beach bag. Let's roll for our scratch. One, two, three, four, five. So if it was a scratch off stick, I would have scratched it. But this bag is number two. And so it's going to be worth $2. So we'll save $2. Roll again. So two, one, two. Let's scratch this one off. Okay, so we got, uh, that's a $3 icon there. Okay. So we'll go ahead and say uh, $3. Like that. And then that's it for those. And like I said, if we were to do a roll and save back here, same situation, you set your amounts for your balls and things. We can do, uh, we can leave it at one or two. I don't mind one and two, that's fine. I like I said, I do this when I run out of scratch offs, okay? So here we go. So two. One, two. So number four. All right. We'll just do one on each of these. And then we got five. One, two, three, four, five. That is a $2 bag. Okay. So that's how that goes, guys. And let's count up the see how much money we just saved, guys. Okay. Because <laughs> like a whole bunch of money back here. Okay. <laughs> Trade some of these coins in. We done went ham on these games, okay? So here we go. Let's see. Because I probably would need to probably color in something to get a look even, you know, even it out, okay? All right. One, two, three, four. This is $5. All right. I'm put that over there. And then this is... Fifty cent. All right, so that's sixty. So let's go ahead and play our mini challenges as well. Like I said, this is for leftover money. So we'll do a few rolls on it, okay? Just so you know what to do. Anchors away. All right, so you'll roll um, one or two die. Well, one die. We got a four, so that's gonna be a fifty cent icon. So we'll say fifty cent. And then you can like color in your uh, anchor if you want to, or you can uh, exit out like that. Okay. So I'm going to put my amounts on here and permanent marker. All right. Let's do a couple more rows. All right. Here we go. Five. That's a 75 cent one. Like I said, you can cross it out if you want to. All right, 75 cent. We got a one, so there's a 25 cent. Let's go one more time. Five. Okay, that's another 75. I'll put that 25 cent and get a dollar. All right, one more for the streets. All right, 50 cent. All right, so let me see how much money I got down here so I can cash it in and see what we need to make to round this out to be even, okay? I need that in my hand. 
All right, so we got $2 here. This is three, so we need $3, okay. And then we got 35 cent here. So what we're gonna do is, we're going to make the, let's see. We're gonna do another 50 cent. So that means we can cross off um, another one of those. I need to do a 75, we just gonna do a 75 cent, I think. Yeah, we do a 75 cent. And then we're just gonna cross off, uh, this will make a dollar. And then just donate the other 10 cent back to the game, like that. And that is how it goes, guys, all right? So now we don't have any money, so now we can count to see what we, what we made today, what we saved by playing all these games, okay? They were so fun, okay, <laughs> by the way. <laughs> All right, so here we go. We got five, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, one, two, three, four, twenty-four plus one, two, three, four, five, plus ten. Twenty-four plus ten is thirty-four dollars, okay? So we played all those games with only $34, guys, okay? So as you can see, and we've been on camera for about, what, 30 minutes playing games, okay? For $34, because that's how we do it here on Saving with Shalana. We have fun with our money. We make our money stretch and all those type of things. But that's it, guys. This is the new kit. Like I said, I'm going to make some revisions on the above deck game, okay? Like I said, card games are the hardest to make, okay? So like I said, I'll see. Yeah, I'm going to fix that one. <laughs> All right, to make it make more sense, okay? I just don't want to give you like a card pool game, like pull the suit kind of thing. I was just trying to try something different, but it might be a pull the suit game, okay? We'll figure it out though. <laughs> All right, guys, like I said, I've already showed you um, how it looks already, so I'm not gonna go do that again like I normally do to end my videos because you've seen it already, the full set. But this is a page, a 12 page download, so it's gonna be $11.99 over on Etsy. And it will be up by tomorrow, I would say. Let me make the corrections on that above deck game, okay? And any other corrections I need to make. But um, that is it, guys. And like I said, you see it's in my book now. You see, you see my book getting thick. Look at her. She's thick, okay? <laughs> uh, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, okay? Thursday ain't in here, but Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Saturday, bingo. It's popping in here, okay? But this is my new, you know, my new weekly book that I'm playing with all my challenges and stuff in it so far. But uh, for the week, for my videos, okay, my video book. Like I said, she looking good. All these downloads are available over on Etsy, guys. So if you want to make you a Saving with Shalana book by the day, okay, because we save every day over here. We save seven days a week. Unless we try to, we, at least we try to, okay. <laughs> But this video long enough, guys, I am done. But again, get it back into the view, how beautiful it is. Cruise Control, available on Etsy. Will be available by tomorrow, okay? I'll put a community post up when it's ready for purchase if you're interested in this kit, all right? So I am done here. Um, have a good night, and I will see you. Have a great day. Well, it's gonna be Debbie Pisces, guys. But have a, enjoy the rest of your day, and I'll see you later. Bye.